So guys, welcome to this knife video. I want to talk about knife steels. My kind of outlook on my philosophy on knife steel right now. I mean, it could change. I don't claim to be a knife expert. I don't claim to be a steel expert. I've been using 5160. And... I thought about going to 52100 because 52100 gives you 1% carbon content, which is up there, super high carbon. And you have 1% chromium. So for example, like I'm the, the survival knives, I've made two of them so far. This was 5160. So this has 0.60 percent carbon content it's essentially like 1060 carbon steel with one percent chromium and that one percent chromium it doesn't make it a stainless steel all it does what I love about it is when you're shining the blade up when you add that little one percent chromium in there it helps you to get a nice beautiful shiny blade so but the thing about 52100, it when you go up to the, the high carbon, that 1%, yes, you get more carbon. Everybody knows that carbon cuts. But when you when you go up in carbon, you also go up in the reality that that blade can rust easier. The more carbon you have, you really need to have more chromium. That's why I like stainless steels like OS 8 and OS 10, they have a high, high amount of carbon, but they also put a high amount of chromium in there. So, but you, say you take a steel like 1095, it's high carbon, it doesn't have any chromium in it. It makes a really not good knife steel, but you just you have to keep the blade oiled. You have to keep it protected. So there's some trade-offs. I can use 52100, but have the one which will have the one percent carbon, and it will have the one percent chromium. You're still going to have to oil the blade and take care of it, even if you have the 5160. With the higher carbon, you're going to have better edge retention. It's going to last longer. That secondary cutting edge, when you're out in the field and you're working, it's going to have the edge retention is going to last longer than fit, fit, you know 52100 compared to this 5160. So you're still going to have to take care of if you have, whether this is 52100 or 5160, you still got to keep your blade oiled. They're both susceptible to rust but when you bring it up to if you use the 52100 you're definitely going to have to protect that blade more so there's a trade-off to me so what does it make sense to use should I keep using the 5160 or the 52100 to me I would rather if I'm going to have to put oil on this blade anyway and take care of it I'd rather have the more carbon in the 52100 even though it's got also 1% chromium because you're going to have better edge retention so you're going to have to take care of that blade just as if you it was 5160 normally 5160 normally they're used for swords and really large bowie knives so I'm probably going to go to the 52100 so it just makes sense to me to go to it. So that's kind of my thoughts on that. I just want to share those with you. Appreciate you guys watching this video.